All right. Ah, <laughs> zen zen yo. They're saying they want to go for a full song right from the start. So here we go. Kiki, I'm going to play Kiki. So that song, because so many people were asking, that song is called Kiki, and it, it's, it's named after Kiki. It's their self-titled self, self song. And there are a lot of questions coming in about the shamisen. So today, we're gonna kind of walk through and do a little bit of a shamisen Q&A, do a little bit of explaining as we kind of do a bit of a performance. Uh, today's gonna be kind of a mix of both. Kiki's definitely gonna be playing a lot more songs. Again, if you haven't hit that like button already, give that like button some love. We kind of wanted to do a special little, we're working on a project right now, which is why we have all the, the, the crazy setup and everything like that going on. And we thought today would be a really good opportunity to share it with you because right now, today in Japan, what's today? 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 What Please play macaron. Okay. There you go. You want to hear okay. macaron? Okay. Next, next song is macaron. Uh, next okay. song is macaron. Oh, let's, ju let's just jump right into it. Why waste time? Now, 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 Macaron. All right. Look at that. Kiki taking requests right from the beginning. Don't forget to give that like button some love. Show Kiki some support here, guys. This next song is called Macaron. Thank uh -huh. 
There we go, guys. Again, this song was called Macaron. Which album is that from? <laughs> Kiki no me. Maybe from Kiki no me. And yes, uh, so each of them have slightly different itomaki or tuning pegs. So Hikari's tuning pegs here are, yes, shaped like Sakura. And Kanami's are shaped more like what? Hoshi? Star? Stamp? Six star? Six star. So, yeah, um, and I have, mine is sitting way the heck over here with the coffee and everything, <laughs> and mine is just all twisty, and they're called Uzumaki. Uzumaki. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, uh, Tim says, when will Kiki release a new CD? Tsugino. Mada kimatte nai. Mada And no, no timeline yet. Maybe, maybe next year? Maybe next year? So, and uh, yeah, I just wanted to give a special welcome to a few different people in here. For example, Tim, who is a member of the Patreon crew. Hi, Tim. Uh, as well as Molly, who's always been a huge supporter of the channel. Molly, thank you so much for being in here. I am so excited to have each and every one of you. I wish I could just mention you all by name and welcome you. But what we want to do today is... Oh, Has Kiki ever played with the Yoshida brothers? They played at the same event. We did an event last year called Shami Fest. Shami Fest. Shami Fest was huge. Uh, it was like every Shamisen player. Like everyone. Except for me, because I was recording it. So, yeah, and both uh, the Yoshi Brothers and Kiki played at that event. Just kind of scroll. <laughs> How do I get CDs of Kiki in the US? America, they ah, CD iTunes. iTunes? Yes. Well, homepage. <laughs> or from the homepage. You can send them a message from the homepage as well. Ohayou gozaimasu. So what we're going to do is we're going to cycle through a couple different songs and in between each song we're going to do a little tiny mini uh, uh, kind of Q&A like this. Also, uh, Gemma, thank you so much. Uh, make sure the watch count transfers over to likes. I'll thank you so much. Yes, uh, likes and all that are very, very much uh, appreciated. Yeah, Simon's saying, will Suzu, Suzune? Suzune yeah, Suzune. Uh, will Suzune uh, perform again? Mata. Mosugu. <laughs> soon, soon, very soon. Um, you now, if you're wondering a little bit more about the shamisen, like what the strings are made from and everything like that, I did a video over on my channel called Playing the Japanese Shamisen. Uh, Spotify. Um, uh, Spotify. Spotify. Mm. There's, there's also, I'm, I'm like mixing languages now. I don't, I don't know which language to speak. So, what song do you guys want to do next? Next. Tuning and everything is covered in that video on uh, what it, what it's like to play a Japanese shamisen. So, again, feel free to. I, I basically went over all the basics and what it is like to actually. So, what song are we doing? Motsunabe? Oh, they're gonna go with one of their classics called Motsunabe. Ringo Bushi. That that's like a real, real classic. So or Tsugaru Jongara Bushi will save that until the very, very end. So okay. Alright, let's turn this around. And Hey Kichi, good to see ya. This is called Motsunabe.
I can like I can already hear everybody clapping. Just like, <laughs> there we go. All right. So again, that song was called Motsu Nabe. Yeah, actually. So I put out on Instagram uh, uh, the question like, what do people want to see from Kiki? And one of the best questions that we got is, how long does it take to put on these kimono? So one of the things that we did today is we shot a little bit of a project in between projects of how long and how Kiki put on their kimono. And believe it or not, it is lightning, lightning fast. So there are so many different, well, there's a lot of requests for like songs and whatnot in here. I think one of the songs that we will do close to the end is going to be Tsugaru Jongara Bushi. But we're definitely, I think right now we're like, 96 likes. We're definitely going to have to hit at least 100 likes before we go to the next song just to turn it into a fun little game. Someone mentioned that they are playing a newer style. Do they know any more traditional sounding songs? <laughs> so if you want to go for one of the like original まあ、どうしてもいいよ。なんか、じゃあ、リンゴ節、リンゴ節でなんかみんなリンゴ節好きだから、we're going to go for a, a really traditional song called Ringo Bushi next. And wow, those likes all flew in there, so. Oh. Oh, oh come on. No small voices. So, while Hikari plays, Kiki is going to give us an extra special treat today and do a little bit of singing. And honestly, she oh, just has one of the most amazing singing voices amazing. ever. Amazing. <laughs> 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 okay, I'm not going to get into it. She's saying, she's like, oh, no, I'm not really good at singing. It's, no. All right, so the next song we are doing is called Dingo Bushi. Dingo, for those of you who don't know, means apple. <laughs> there we go. As I said, Kanami is an absolutely spectacular singer. I've always really enjoyed listening to Kanami's singing. So now before we get into the next song, I'd like to do a little bit of a Q&A. So if you have any Shamisen related questions, drop them in. Oh, Molly, thank you so much for the super chat. A bunch of comments come in. I do not want to miss this. Always love your live videos. You all rock. Well, Molly, thank you so much for being a part of it. Are there styles of shamisen playing where you do finger picking instead of the shamisen pick? So usually shamisen uses this here. It's called a bachi. And there are styles like shamisen that don't use this, that use finger picking, and that's called a sanshin. And it's like a tiny, tiny little Okinawa shamisen that's covered in snake. Like, sanshin poi oto te daseru. Yeah, sanshin sounds a lot more like that. And then there's like, then there's like Kyoto style shamisen, which is more like when you imagine geisha 
and whatnot. And that would be like Kyoto style right there. And Kyoto style will actually use a, like a, a much more delicate pick, sometimes wood or plastic. But Sugaru Shamisen needs to use a really strong pick because when they play, they really, really hit the skin. Can you see it? Can you? So you can't really see it now, but like, Hikari has some of the scariest arms. Pichan's arms almost rival my own in terms of like, look at that, that is terrifying. I might even lose to you, like, geez. The muscle in that forearm is insane. You're just a little bit scary. Just, just a little scary. <laughs> so the scariest arms so there we go uh yeah that is kind of the difference between the different shamisen types now one of the most popular songs in the tsugaru shamisen repertoire is a song called tsugaru jongara bushi so i think we're going to start by sharing a little bit of tsugaru jongara bushi with you guys this is a very, very challenging song for each player to play. It's very tiring, but it's by far one of the best songs in the shamisen repertoire.
There we go. So, uh, thank you. Yeah. Let me turn this around. That was really good. Are you tired? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 So Kiki and I are just taking a little bit of a break from a pretty big project <laughs> that we are shooting right now. If you guys have any final questions, this right here, this is the, I guess, best chance to ask them. There was one really good question in there, and it was, do you have a place outside of your home to practice? Um, they say they can't really <laughs> practice that often at their house. Can I be saying karaoke? Karaoke. Me too. You too? Me too. Or just my house, right? Oh. Karaoke. <laughs> oh. They can even practice at karaoke or they can come here and play anytime. We've actually been getting together every single month to record a really big project just for you guys. Something that you're hopefully gonna get a lot of value out of, a lot of enjoyment out of. So yeah, uh, let me turn this around and we'll do a, a brief walkthrough. If I, there we go. So we have a mini shamisen right here and um, I, I'm gonna walk through later on one that, you can actually get these in Japanese gacha. Keep an eye on my Instagram stories. Oops, there we go. Keep an eye on my Instagram stories and I will uh, share a little, ah, I killed it. <laughs> and I will share a little bit about these tiny gacha here. Um, uh, what do I have to search for Kiki on Spotify? Spotify? Spotify, what do you search for Kiki? Uh, yeah, if you copy the, if you copy the, if you copy the kanji from one of their, their videos, uh, it should come up, but, so, uh, yeah, uh, how often do you create new songs? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've been putting a lot of pressure on them to make new songs. Yeah. I've been putting a lot of pressure on Kiki to make new songs so we can make new videos. We also have a totally other channel where we only do Shamisen stuff called Shamisen in Tokyo. If you haven't seen that yet, definitely feel free. They already have the Zimbu website on Yoteru. Uh, okay, they haven't put it on the website yet, but they do have a couple shows around the Olympics as well. As soon as this video is done, what I'm going to do is I'm going to link everything in the description box down below so that you guys can check it out if you want to. This has been a lot of fun. Um, the fastest song... Not ichiban hayai kyoku. Ichiban hayai kyoku. Ah, the song that they just played, Jongara, um, they can actually play it a lot faster. Alright, so as so right now, Mate, before they start, right now the likes are at 141. If we get to 150 likes, Kiki is going to play something that is absolutely crazy fast. It is part of it's like a Jongara-ish thing. It's going to be super short, but all of the difficult techniques in Shamisen are in there. So it's called Tsugaru Rokudan. And they're going to play the Ichidan section. All right. Okay, here we go. <laughs> there we go. So yeah, um, that is 
the, the most of the uh, Tsugaru stuff is based off of Rokudam, and that is one section out of six sections. But that is an example of it being played dangerously fast. So there we go. That yeah, it is crazy fast. So they, like, he did it. Okay, that is. So the question came up, and it was a really good question of who controls the pace or the tempo. While they're playing, when they're playing together, they do something called kakegoe. p i c h a n can you give me kakegoe? Hop, hop. There we go. That's a kakegoe. <laughs> And this notifies the other player that they're about to change or go into another section. So when they're doing like a kamashi, like the dipi 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 dipi, they go hop. Then they know to go to the next section, but in terms of pace and everything like that, they usually control it together. So mm, yeah. uh, it'll just kind of start, and then they'll 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 hear each other and just kind of feel it out. Mm. So that's kind of how that plays out. So guys, thank you so much, thank so much so for joining much. this so stream. Thank We you. are going to wrap everything up right now, and we're going to get back to work for the day. We have a lot of videos to shoot for you guys. Mm -hmm. I'm talking dozens and dozens of videos that we are working on right now. If you've joined this and you've enjoyed it, feel free to go back and watch. When I end this stream, I want to hang out with you guys down in the comments section over the weekend. So please leave me a comment on the final video as well. If you liked it, share it with somebody, and I will link everything from Kiki down below. Thank you. Thank you. And、uh, we will talk to you guys again. Real soon. Love you guys. Bye bye. Bye bye.